Congratulations on growing your own fresh, healthy produce with Tower Garden. In this video, we're going to show you how to manually pollinate fruit bearing plants. You may need to manually pollinate plants if you don't see bees or other pollinators around your tower garden. While no tools are required, you may find manual pollination is easier to achieve with the help of a q tip, toothbrush, or paintbrush. There are two types of fruit bearing plants those with self-pollinating flowers, and those with separate male and female flowers. Flowers of self-pollinating plants such as tomatoes, peppers, eggplant, peas, green beans, and others contain all the necessary parts to produce fruit. To pollinate these plants, you must transfer pollen to the pistil, which is in the middle part of the flower. One way to accomplish this is by gently brushing the inside of the flower with a paintbrush, Q-tip, or similar tool. Alternatively, you may grasp the center stalk of the plant and gently shake the plant to stimulate pollen release. Plants like squash, zucchini, pumpkins, cucumbers, and others produce separate male and female flowers. The male flower will typically have a slender stalk and pollen-laden stamens and the female flower will usually have a small budding fruit at its base. To pollinate these plants, swab the inside of the male flower with a small paintbrush, Q-tip, or similar tool, and then immediately swab the inside of the female flower to transfer the pollen. You may also achieve pollination by picking a male bloom, peeling off its petals, and lightly dusting pollen onto the pistils of the female flowers using the male stamen. It's easiest to pollinate early in the morning when the blooms are open. After you manually pollinate your plants, you should begin to see fruit within a few days. We hope you enjoy abundant, delicious yields from your tower garden.